This is the heart and soul of a Christian. If you're not praying, you're playing. If you're not praying, Satan has got you where he wants you. You see, your prayer is a weapon. Satan wants to drive you away from him. Can he do that to a Christian? Oh, yes, he can. And a Christian driven away from the light of fellowship with God will stumble practically as bad as an unsaved man. Here's what it says in Romans 8, 26. Likewise, the Spirit also helpeth our infirmities. For we know not what we should pray for as we ought. The Spirit, when it takes over for you, is able to read what's going on inside your soul better than you can read what's going on inside your soul. And intercedes for you to Christ at the right hand of the Father who's able to give us what we need. So have you gone into your prayer closet and just kind of got to where you really didn't know what to say but your heart was broken and you began to pour it out to God and it just got deeper and deeper and you felt someone begin to take you up and hold you and begin to present that to the Father that's what's going on here you need that light that fellowship and the work of the Holy Spirit is to see to it that that fellowship is maintained it's not up to you to keep it maintained all you have to do is agree agree with God if you don't know what to say, preacher, I don't know what to say. Just get down and pour your heart out to God. Just help me is a powerful prayer.